Hello everyone, welcome back to the Foxtech YouTube channel. This time I'm going to show you some things here regarding the Apple Wallet, more specifically how you can share tickets from the Apple Wallet. Now, there are some things you should know about because of course, if you have a boarding pass that you want to share or something specific to you, it may not work because it may be tied to you as a person, but you can still use the wallet app to share it. So if you open up the wallet like this, let's say I have this like a sample uh, pass the boarding pass which isn't real of course with the name John Appleseed it's not going to be the real thing but in case I want to share it there is the option to do so so if I click on the three dots right there it's going to show me uh, more options so I can either get some notifications about it remove it or get more details so the information is what I want to click on you can see that I have some options here uh, all the stuff which I want but in case I want to share it I have the share button at the top of the page so I'm gonna lower the brightness a bit more so click on share and now I basically have the option to share it as much as I want so you can use all the things which are available to you in my case is just email and airdrop as well but um, by the way guys if you want to know everything about your iphone apps you have to click the link down below in the description it's a hundred percent free education platform where i publish like video editing courses there is going to be the all apps explained course which is coming up it's going to explain every single app on your iphone it's going to be really cool so go ahead and check out that link it's free to access so yeah go ahead and do that right now I'm going to show it, show it to you how you can share it, to, for example, through AirDrop. So if I just set up AirDrop on my other device, I'm going to click on that, the uh, iPhone. I'm going to accept it right here and it's going to probably add it right here. So the option I have right now is to either add it to my wallet. And by that, this is already part of my wallet of the other iPhone. So that it's a very easy way to share it. For example, you may not use that. You perhaps may want to use the email or some different apps, depending on what you have available. This iPhone doesn't have any third party apps installed, so I don't have many options to pick from, but you can basically share it any way you want. And that's basically everything you need to know about it in case there are some other additional information about it for example you have a specific app to be part of that because if i show it to you on this other iphone i have a card right here which is a membership card and if i go in here you can see that this is like a uh the from the gas station card so in here you can see that i have the app right here so for example you may also share the app actual so if you can actually link it back to the app which have been using it with and you can share the app from the app store as well that's another option plenty of things to pick from but i'm gonna wrap up this video right here i've shown you all the things which are important in regards to this topic so i'm gonna wrap up this video right here thank you very much for watching hope you found it useful if you did make sure to leave a thumbs up but definitely subscribe down below so you don't miss the next videos in the future thanks a lot for watching see you guys later